sample loading uh, using a, a liquid. Um, the third option for injecting your sample, if they tend to be on the viscous side or you expect that the uh, sample may not fully soak into the column, is to use an injection valve. And what you do after you equilibrate the column and you get the sample load box showing is to remove the inlet tubing and take the sample injection valve and attach that to the top of that tubing, to the top of the column. You would take your solvent line and attach that to the side port and then you can take your sample and you can use a syringe and do a liquid load. And inject whatever volume you want. So this is a valve and so it's got the ability to change flow directions. So right now with the arrow pointing horizontal, it's going to accept solvent from the pump. In the down position, it allows you to inject the sample. So what's nice is if your sample is going to have a tendency to blow back, once you've depressed the plunger, you can turn the valve and then start your chromatography. Mm -hmm. Thank you.